Hey, hey, everyone. I, uh... Oh. It's not only God's care because of the first bot. I, once again, I'm being a little bit too lazy to actually stream on YouTube. I've been thinking of ways to actually get rid of this little bit of laziness, and I think the perfect way to get rid of it is to actually just make, like, a single thumbnail for, like, most of the videos that I'm going to be having on, like, YouTube, like, the streams. That way, I don't have... Like, the thing that's bothering me the most is just, like, making the thumbnail. Anyways, uh, Kawa here. Uh, today, I also decided that I want to be cute, and I have a bit of free time, about two hours and a half. So I wanted to continue with Chapter 3 for Senseless, Senseless Zone Zero, since uh, I'm very curious as to where this is going to lead us, because this is supposed to be, like, the last chapter. <clears throat> Sorry. This is supposed to be, like, the last chapter that there's going to be for this, uh, for this, like, version of the game, and the next version is coming next week. So I want to try to finish this one. Watch. The, uh, the trailer for like the next uh, update and then we'll see what uh then I'll see what I'm gonna end up doing because uh, there's things that I want to do I kind of want to start Wubba back up I need to continue with Honkai Impact and uh, I think one of the best ways that I can do uh, all both of those things is just to actually like free myself up slowly from like the gotchas that I've, I've started up and uh, I also need to stop being so well, I need to start streaming more, but it's such a difficult thing because because of the reasons that I haven't been streaming, which aren't bad. They they aren't bad reasons. It's simply just that uh, there's people. That, I, I think I've mentioned this like a couple times before, but there's like people that I really like as like streamers, and uh, I'm just like a a big watcher. Uh, well, not like a big watcher to them, but I just like being uh. I like watching them and I like supporting them and I like being in their chat and chatting up and like talking or playing video games if they have like some sort of like open lobby and stuff like that and i just kind of like that um i have a lot of fun just being uh you know just there just being like the fly on the wall <laughs> kind of thing so yeah i kind of like enjoy that and i i do want to keep doing that but the issue is that oftentimes when i start doing that uh uh because of like their own streaming schedules i sort of sort of lose uh, a lot of like my time my like own time if I had to like mention it that way, it's not like I, it's a lost time, uh, in general, that's, a, that's in like a bad thing. Uh, but yeah, I pretty much just like don't really give much time to myself. It's also usual, uh, also it's one of the reasons why a lot of times I have like a terrible sleeping schedule because, uh, I sit through like their entire streams and uh, they end really late because they're more of a full time streamer or like they're bigger streamers. Um, or, like they stream longer hours than me, pretty much. And they end uh, their stream pretty late at night. And after they're done with their stream, I start doing my own like dailies for like my gacha games or things that I had to do, uh, optional things that I had to do in like my, my house and stuff like that. Like, you know the dailies or weeklies or whatever for like the, my gacha games and uh because those take like some time especially the weeklies the weeklies are the ones that take the most amount of time uh of the day i just end up finishing my day pretty much close to the daily reset for a lot of these games uh that i'm playing and uh yeah uh, that that reset time for me is like 2 a.m so and that's sleeping around that time which means that i only get a uh, like three to four hours of sleep of sleep four hours if i get lucky three hours is like the usual uh sleep that i end up getting uh <laughs> which is like not very good for my health i know but uh yeah uh that's usually like the case of uh, how i am not like streaming that much even though like the thing that one of the reasons that i uh i was streaming like way more when i was like you know unemployed uh was one because i was unemployed and two because i wasn't really watching those people and three because the time that i was streaming was not anywhere close to the time um uh, they're like the start time of the people that i'm currently watching plus a couple of the people that i'm watching currently i didn't know them yet <clears throat> so i wasn't like uh mm, you know, going to their, like, stream, it, it was only, like, one or two people that I usually just, like, went over to, like, their stream and just, like, sit through it, but, uh, they didn't really have, like, uh, yeah, like I mentioned, like, their, their schedules for, uh, their streaming times, uh, weren't, like, anywhere close to my time, because it was just, like, I started streaming at, like, 10 a.m., and I finished by, like, 2 p.m., and they'd start streaming, like, at, uh, I don't know, like, between 7 to 9 p.m. my time, which is, like, you know, it's a, it's a big time difference compared to now because now i have like my job 
So I like finish my work and I come back home at between like 12 to like 2 p.m. And then uh, it's like 30 minutes of um, just like commute to my house. Then it's 30 more minutes to uh, eat my food because I take my time eating. And then after that, I sort of like start streaming. And by the time that I start streaming, there's like, I don't know, like one hour or like a, an hour and a half before the, the person that I want to watch starts streaming. So then I just like try to do things like very, very fast. Or sometimes I feel like, oh, I'm not going to be able to do anything. So why should I even stream today? Uh, kind of thing. And uh, <clears throat> yeah, that's usually the problem. But today I have a... I'm still going to be doing the same thing. And I had, uh, well, I did mention that I had like two hours or like two hours and a half to stream, but I already wasted five minutes of it with my japping. So today I do want to continue with the story because I am very interested as to where this is going to actually end up leading us because this is chapter three. Like I mentioned before, like I heard from someone that the story is supposed to get like sad at one point, And I don't know if they, it's going to get sad either on this chapter, uh, like sad as like an experience that's gonna something that's gonna happen to like the siblings or if it was because of like chapter two ending with like coletta uh having like the thing with her dad and the uh the prototype which i still cannot remember its name i've forgotten to actually look up the name of the prototype uh, but yeah uh i don't know if that was like the reason why they they mentioned that the game was gonna get like sad because it, it did bring like a tear to my eye, but it was more of like a tear of happiness and excitement from like that whole uh, mecha moment of just like, you know, and like mecha animes and stuff like that, where there's like a point in time where they're like fighting the big bad. And it's like uh, the uh, the mecha has like a name to it. And they call out their name, just like, don't go down on me in the name of the mecha. And then they just like push through with like with the, um, like the handles to control like the mecha or something like that and then the uh, the mecha just like bursts with like power and they're able to like def and some sort of like epic battle with epic music uh starts up um uh i guess like the baddie and stuff like that and it's just like it, it gave me that feel and it was a really good uh like a very very good feel so i was very very happy and i was like of course kind of sad about the thing that happened to like her father father even though we don't really know what happened to him we know he got shot because of the bullet uh holes that there were inside the cabin of the prototype but we never found the body which is well not a surprise because that place was inside the hollow and it was inside the hollow for who knows how long uh i don't know the timings between when uh Coletta's father disappeared and the current time but I all I know is that it's supposed to be before the um the thing that happened to the old capital where it just got consumed by a big hollow before like the holes ended up appearing in this like world I think that's what ended up happening it's just like the holes just started appearing in the world uh like on that moment when people lost like the old capital uh there should be I mean there should totally be uh some sort of like information about it somewhere i can probably go back wait there's a way to look at my vr right hang on i've seen it before hold f no it's mail nope it's not m district details and i didn't know about that <laughs> i actually had never looked at that uh there should be a way more and then there's vr oh this isn't this ain't it all right uh i probably only gained that because i finally decided to do the training for suyun and i can finally understand how you're supposed to play her she's very very similar to billy where she gets like the ability to reposition herself in the middle of her basic attacks and she can also do it on her like enhanced uh, basic attacks i wish i actually knew from the start that she had that those like enhanced basic attacks instead of having to like uh find out about it on my own but luckily, I found about it very, very well fast. Um, just because I, I decided to try out holding a mouse button because nothing else was working uh, to use like the little bullet, the enhanced bullets. Uh, until I ended up doing that, and then I noticed like, oh, you're supposed to like do this to be able to use like the enhanced shot, and then you just like gain them back on like uh, ex skills and auto attacking and the um, the assist and stuff like that. Um, I actually finished this today, the the seven days for this this um uh, this event. It was pretty fast, and I mean it's nice stuff. The things that they gave you, a couple of, like free uh, polychromes. 
I am not going to be rolling for Su Juan. I'm going to be waiting for Jane Doe because I love her animations. <laughs> I really like them. And before I start um, rolling for... Actually, I don't know if I should roll for the next Bang Boo or not. I don't know what Jane Doe is. I don't know what um, what's the word for it. What affiliation she has. Because if her affiliation is to public security then it's better for me to wait for the next bang boo because the next bang boo is supposed to be public security the public security bang boo uh i was thinking of grabbing the victoria housekeeping bang boo simply because uh in the case that i get like and also because of ellen because if i get like uh because he's also ice then he works on like the team for triple ice where I have her as the uh, the main attacker, I ha have uh, Sokaku as the buffer, and I have um, Lycaon as the last one to get like the bonus, the skill bonus for for all of them, because Lycaon is one from Victoria Housekeeping and two his eyes. Yeah, so that wasn't my plan, but uh, right now I don't really have. Oops, I still haven't bought that. Uh, I don't have enough to actually roll. I need one more. Do I get it on my next level? Internet level. I did not get it on my next level. I need two more levels to get the next master tape. Or I could also finish my whole zeros because I think there's one roll uh, on my whole zero C merits that I can actually get. Yeah. Anyway, let's continue with the story. I've been yapping too much and I've already lost. Uh, let's see. A total of 10 minutes. Okay, good. Nice. Uh, good old yapping old me. Here we go. Let's talk to Rina. I'm presuming you're the guide. It's nice to meet you. I'm Alexandrina Sebastian. You can call me Rina. Rina because of Alexandrina. Eh, Alexandrina. Ah, I see. There we go. It's because of the katakana. Actually, I don't know how it would work on like uh, Chinese because, well, you know, I don't know Mandarin or, Chi or any of like the uh, Chinese languages because there's two of them, right? There's Mandarin and there's another one that's more, uh... what's the word for it? Old? Maybe? I don't know. Why, is Rina called Eos Master Eos? Mm -hmm. That's right. Rina has never met a legendary Bang Boo like Master Eos that can sync up with the guide and travel to and from the hollows. You're very knowledgeable and are in pretty good shape after all these years of service. I'm impressed. Yep, Master Eos is amazing. Mm, this. Didn't I press Eos enough before? Yes, I know. It's a, it's actually all thanks to Wise. Dear Guide, I'm truly touched that you and your sister gave Eos such a warm home after he lost his master. Oh? Son and Lore? Oops, maybe I shouldn't have said anything. I was just really moved by how much Master Eos cares about you too, and couldn't help but share my feelings. I hope you don't mind. It's like Eos says, seems Dina has tricked me into saying something. Mm, maybe she didn't know about it, and then she baited me into just like reacting to that. There's that sort of like way to like gain information. Maybe maybe Dina is actually like somebody that uh, can get information really easily from people in a lot of ways, shapes, and forms. Mm -hmm. Please don't worry, dear guide. Your companion, Eos, is a loyal friend. I think there's more to you than meets the eye, but Master Eos has never thought to reveal your secrets. And after talking with Eos... I wonder if I'm pronouncing its name right. Eos? Eos? I'm convinced that Peyton is an excellent business partner. I look forward to working with you in the future. Thank you, Eos. Is there anything else you want to talk to me about? Talk more. Please, after you, about your work. As you can see, I'm a maid. It's an interesting profession that grants easy access to behind-the-scenes view of glamorous lives. Young politicians in charge of important cases would use internal information to get rich and elevate their social position. After all, who better to confide in than a diligent housemaid who keeps her mouth shut, right? Mmm, so she is in charge of gaining information, or like in, um, in collecting information. Would a long skirt get in the way of work? Thank you very much for your consideration. When I was learning about made etiquette from my head mother, I was questioning this outfit, but I'm used to wearing it now. Also, it's great for storage. For example, a desert that will bring a smile to your face. Would you like to try some vanilla scream scones? 
Do I poison myself? I uh, I have already watched her like trailer, where she makes some god awful purple oozing mist kind of like food, and then also Lycaon also warned me to not accept any food from her. You know what? Let's try it. Don't mind if I do. Help yourself. Ah, some memories resurface. It's an indescribable wave of deep-seated doubt, fear, regret, and despair that crushes your fragile nerves. Uh, wait, what just happened? Logic suggests we shouldn't pry too deeply. What's wrong, my dear guide? Let's stop here for now. There's no need to be formal. I'll be here with Master Eos, so feel free to come find me anytime. And that should be it. Prepare Eos soon after. <laughs> Master Eos looks to be in a good shape. Looks like we can go to Ballad Twins as planned. I'm counting on you for the rest of your uh, our journey, Master Guide. Ooh, now that I think about it, if I, I might get to play Dina, and I don't know how to play her. At this moment, your phone starts ringing. Did he call? Not spell. Hmm. <laughs> I wonder if the, uh, Wise has the same reaction as Belle in this moment. I do wonder if Rain was the one that commissioned uh, Victoria Housekeeping. Oh, there we go. Investigation Ascending Dance. Uh, now where am I supposed to go? Is it really gonna tell me to go all the way back? Oh, no, it won't. Go home and get ready to head out. I mean, I guess I do have to head home, but it doesn't let me TP. Yeah, it doesn't let me TP. I was gonna check something as well. All oh, right, uh, more VR training, Agent Academy. Oh, it's probably not. Yeah, it's not unlocked. All right, never mind. I can't try her out. Oh, wait, I should be able to try her out now that I think about it. Uh, here it is. Start demo. Let's see what she's all about real quick before I actually start playing this mission. When Dina launches a basic attack, special attack, or EX special attack, she sends out Drusilla and Anastella to attack, dealing electrical da electric damage. While well, Drusilla and Estella are attacking, Rina's basic attack combo won't be interrupted by her other attacks. Eh. When either Bang Boo is sent out to attack, pen rations increase for the other squad members. The buff ends when both Drusilla and Anastella return to Rina's side. Mm. So it's ranged attack. Okay. EX special attack. Does it push the enemy? It gets stuck on it. Hmm. Free combat session is about to. What? That's it? Well, that was fast. Can probably do this. Hit with Anton. Trigger the next one, and then go for Rina. She, it seems that she's more of a support rather than a damage dealer. Let's see what her ult is. Oh, I do remember this. I remember watching a video of her. Anton. Yeah, it, so this team is supposed to have like uh, Rina as a support and Anton as the big damage dealer. The thing is that I don't know how to make uh, the little... Oops, Anton. The little bots are like, stay out and keep attacking the enemy. Because right now they just left. So it's not the same as with... Uh, oh, what's her name? I've been using it, her so much, but I still don't know her name. I'm really bad with names. I've mentioned this before. I'm terrible with names. Uh, what's her name? 
Lucy. Lucy's little pets actually stay out and keep helping out uh all the way up until the uh the battle is over or you go out of combat. Uh, which is very different from how Dina was working because her little like bots actually like disappear after a certain amount of time if you're like not using her or attacking with her or something like that. Which means that you just lose like the pin ratio. And for Lucy, you, you keep the attack buff. At this moment in Genos, uh, in the Genos quarter on the helipad on top of the public security building. It's also really curious that we're continuing with this like little storyline because this must mean that something here, some whatever is going to end up happening here, is going to have repercussions on like what's going to be happening to us on the side of like the ballot towers. Oh. Ah. Something has to happen to him. They're gonna like I don't know what's gonna happen to him, but something has to happen to him because he didn't accept the uh the little like contract or thingy that the uh that Victoria housekeeping woman was giving him. Hmm. Hmm. You are the fool. Wait, who's this? This is not the same person. Oh! But what's the trick? Did they put like a bomb on the suitcase or something like that? Mmm, that's suspicious. Also, I have popcorn, so. Oh, Grammy, we can have popcorn. Oh, wait, no, I shouldn't. I forgot. Mm. Since I'm gonna be joining a. Let's call it anime night of uh, one of the persons that I like to watch later, I should keep those popcorn and not eat them. <laughs> So I can actually um, snack on them during the anime night. <laughs> I adore her voice actor, actress. Oh, and you don't know either. You have absolutely no idea how bad the city, how absolutely bad and horrible the city can get. Thinking that you're above that person. <laughs> but what is it gonna be? Is it gonna be a bomb? Is it gonna be something that kills only him? Is it gonna be something that destroys the court? Are they going on the blimp? And if they're going on the blimp, is something gonna happen to it? Ah, there's Billy. <laughs> I love her. <laughs> Wait, they had to run over? Weren't they supposed to catch the blimp? They caught the blimp, right? Or are they barely getting on the blimp? Oh, because he's a robot, of course, Nekomata. <laughs> Can you build muscle? Eh? He can't breathe? Yeah, they are getting on the blimp. Oh. Well, there's something's gonna happen to it. But true, they're gonna be very high up in the air. So they're gonna be losing some oxygen. It's like, you know, atmosphere and stuff like that. Tine, tine. <laughs> well, that's one way to say it. <laughs> Nekomata no Shiriai Gairon de Shaw? Bare Twins that 
ご主人様とやらの所有物って話だし大丈夫よきっと Surely, yeah, I shouldn't be in any danger. Plus, I'm not gonna be inside the tower either. It's gonna be just eels. So, the Nocte Proki Sensei got what I touched to each you team. Ah, well, Victoria housekeeping is very expensive, so I don't think we're gonna be going. We're gonna be working with them a lot because、uh, currently we're not the legendary Peyton. We're just like a random proxy because we lost our account. So we don't have that much money. So, yeah. <laughs> I heard a thunder, I turned over, and I think I just saw a lightning strike the city. Uh huh. Because it didn't look, it would look like it was pretty close, and it looked like it actually ended up covering, uh, like a building. Like it was like in front of like a building. And usually when things show up in front of like something, it means that they're like, you know, in front of them. You know what I mean? Anyways. Uh, I think those guys are completely new and nothing to worry about. I'm really scared. I don't know if something's gonna happen to the blimp because of like the,、uh, the suitcase. But I guess we'll find out later.、Uh, proxy, you there? The bill of the owners make it? Yeah, we made it in the airship right now. We're about to take off soon. Well, I wanna apologize. Really sorry for earlier today.、Hmm? I agreed to look for rain with you, but ended up leaving it to someone else. Is she afraid? That because of,、uh, they had to leave and I ended up going over with like Victoria housekeeping, that she needs to like apologize to seem like a little bit better as an option, like a better person, for me to have like a better、uh, image of her and keep.、Uh... Oh, wait, I didn't even notice that I had like icons and Nico,、uh, icons,、uh, whatchamacallit, contact.、Uh, but yeah, she apologizing to try to get like a better image or to make me feel like bad and not leave her. Here's something weird. Kick, quick, hand your phone to Nekomara. Get her to tell me how bad your food poisoning is. No, no, I'm fine. Don't worry about me. I suddenly realize we've known each other for so l- Suspicious? We've known each other for so long, and although there have been some ups and downs, it's been a pleasure working with you. Hey, you don't want to jinx anything. I don't feel you're going to trust me. You don't want to jinx anything. Are you that nervous about going to court? No, not at all. Don't be ridiculous. Anyway, I've been really grateful to you all. I'll definitely repay you. <laughs> She's trying so hard. <laughs> She's so. I still love her PFP. She has my favorite PFP of like every、uh, any character in the game. It's so cute. And she's cute as well, in general. She's a dummy. This is such a girl failure. I love it. <laughs> Oh, it's been a long time since I've actually done this. I've completely forgotten about it. Oops. It's because、uh, I don't need to do it to complete my my daily, so I often forget about it. Anyways, Belle, time to go in.、Hmm, I don't believe it. Nicole just tanked us in a DM she just sent? That's weird. Why'd she suddenly say that? Sounds kind of ominous. You see some piggies flying in the sky? Let's wait for them to come back and ask. Anyway. I'm going, to, I'm going to save this messages of Nicole saying she wants to repay us in case she recalls them and denies ever saying it. Why is Victoria Housekeeping just contacted us? They're saying they are ready to leave. From now on, we should be able to,、uh, we should also focus our, we should also shift our focus back to Valid Twins.、Mm -hmm. Onwards to Chapter 3. It's only the second one. How many were there in Chapter 2, I wonder? Should have been like, It's five, six. Let me click on it.、Uh, easy. One, two, three, four, five. Only five. But there's a lot of like story between them. So yeah. Let me click on it. Next. Okay. Oh, I also don't know how to play Lycow, and I forgot to actually check his thing, but <sighs> whatever. If I keep trying to check like their trials and stuff like that, I'm just gonna end up、uh, losing more and more time.
ロキシ様ご友人がビートの屋上にとどまっていた可能性があるのならまずはそこを目指すのはいかがでしょううん。あらばいけるわそこに向かってしまっていいのかいそちらの仕事に支障がないといいけれど。Or is the idea, or is it the idea that they need to like clean up the entire tower, just like going to one tower first from like bottom to the top, and continues to like fulfill like the, the work that they're here for, which is like cleaning up the ethereals in the area? お気遣い、痛み入ります。ええ。あなた様は、私どもがもてなすべきお客様でございます。It's such a shame that you are a full on. That you're too far on the furry spectrum. Such a shame, like how on. Go you jing and then there are Kakshoga Nago Descara. Now Sarakoto a cue Yoshmas. That's true. To Joe, but actually, the more maintenance or Konan Kotoga Nikiba, so in a cold it's to still a best of the show. Yeah, this is what I mentioned, but it's true that we don't know anything about rain. We know that she has been sending those like messages, those like uh, blank messages to people. So if she's in danger, then it'd be good to actually go and check up on her first. Hmm. A hand drawn blueprint provided by Victoria Housekeeping, Housekeeping Company. Cool. It clearly outlines the uh, structure of the Ballad Twins and the route to the rooftop of Tower B. We went cut in exchange a knowing glance, confirming that Lycon was the one who drew it. <laughs> That's cute. <laughs> so we need to travel a lot to be able to reach the rooftop of B because we need to go up Tower A, go through the bridge, and then go up Tower B. She's such an onessant. Right, thanks, Fairy. Devote the good work. <laughs> eh? Fairy is also being really nice all of a sudden. Ugh. <laughs> Kinda sus. Not gonna lie. I think the most important thing about playing with like Alan is checking if he has some sort of like bar or resource. Gotta go slowly just in case I find another one of those ghosts by accident. Ah, talking about it. <laughs> Two of them. Do they stack? They do. And I can still see them. Right. Get out of here. Retrigger the event. I can turn it off, and eh, that's interesting. I can probably use that to actually bait them in. They're not here anymore, so I should check the areas where they were supposed to be. Oh, uh, was it over there? What's up here? All right, there's nothing. Onwards. More Denny's. Another one. Two of them. Three of them. I need to activate all of them. I see three marks. Hmm. Oh, here's one. It is. I wonder. It's always gonna be three things. It's a rule of three. This is always such a bother on some like quest for video games. That's it. What about this? 
I she gotta turn this on. What is this? Oh, I see. So yeah, I just turn this off. I let it get close. Then I use it to actually destroy it. Yeah, that's how I'm supposed to do it. Or maybe I could actually just go right and then up here and then go towards this one. Yeah, probably could have done that as well. Get all the money. Turn on the light. There's something down here. I can't remember. Oh, this. Hmm. Wait, so I'm moving closer? Uh... I'm running away. I'm actually kind of scared. Oh, hi. Open the door. Turn off the light. To move closer and then destroy it. Easy. Anything else over here? Doesn't look like it. It's just a little rest thingy, but I'm just gonna touch it. Just yeah, it doesn't do anything. Maybe what the, the what these things do is actually make my pre but I don't have these either. Oh, I don't have the corruption thing either. Kind of confused. Slightly confused. All right, let's see what Lycan can do. Also, one thing that I gotta say about uh, characters, uh. A long time ago, I watched One Piece, and I really, really liked the the way that Sanji fights with only his like feet because, uh, or like only his legs, because of the thing of uh, hmm, a chef should not dirty his own hands while fighting someone, so I will only use my legs, kind of thing. But it's just like I find leg attacks to be like so cool, and Nightowen only attacks with his like legs. Okay, I found uh I found out what Lycaon does. He charges his attacks. But man, like his animations are so damn good. It's a damn crime against humanity. I should probably do Rina. Wait, I wonder. Nice. Is that gun not DPS? Is it possible that Lycan is stunned? Is that why he's able to just like fill out the gauge so quickly? Like he only does it with two attacks, pretty much. Perfect. Nice try. So this team, the supposed to DPS is supposed to be Corin. Dina is supposed to be the uh, the support assist. Oh. Because he's not doing that much damage, to be honest. But I don't want to see his ult. <laughs> Onto the DPS. 
And yeah, she deals a lot of damage. Like, <laughs> a lot of damage. Ouch. Ouch! Wasn't paying attention. These animations are so good, man! My, I think I get the, uh, the dynamic of this team now. Oh, more thunders. I gotta keep an eye out. Uh, actually, I should do it right now. I'm just gonna go over to the next... Uh, uh, to the other rooms. And... Oh, that one's half closed already. Just need to do this room. Here we go. Just need to close the window a little bit. <laughs> For when it starts raining so the water doesn't get in because uh, oftentimes water has gotten into the house not that much as what's for the, the house to like get flooded or anything of this sort i don't think that's ever happened to uh the house so yeah but it's still it's uh can be very very bothersome for water to get in because they can get in onto like the mm, the furniture and well damage it so yeah it's pretty bad ah I see what's gonna end up happening. Uh, so the the lights are gonna turn off, and then a bunch of like ghosts are gonna appear behind me, and we're gonna have to run towards the door and lock it behind us. <laughs> I mean, it's nice to have some security. <laughs> Uh, yep. Do this again, and there's gonna be another one. <laughs> she says Gamba. That's cute. Oh, ooh. Uh huh. She's gonna turn on the lights. Hmm. But we still have nowhere to go. Oh, infrared camera. Cameras are commonly found within the power twins, enabling clear vision even in the darkness when unutilized. Okay. Oh, so it shows me where to go. He... Hmm. Oh, so I can't move. Uh... Oh, I see. Yeah, and that doesn't affect me. Can I move up? Oh, I am the Flash. Eh. Am I supposed to... Do I need to catch that thing? A hazy shadow looms before you. Seems like it can only be discerned clearly using the night vision mode. You also notice it's giving off a distinct aura, unlike the other ones uh, you ran into before. Is he trying to say something? Hmm. What are those things truly ghosts? A little shadow flickered, as if responding to Lycan's words. Uh, something about the door. So I can leave this door over here to you then? Hmm. Okay. Now I move up, grab that thing, and now I can use the infrared and move to the left 
and grab this ghost. There we go. Mm, there's something down here. Just a shortcut over here, a bunch of money over to the right, a rest area and some loot. Oh, nothing. All right, time to go back. Oh. Hmm. I wonder why. I wonder what's going on that's making it flicker. Is what I said truly gonna happen? Or I'm just gonna get chased by the enemies at one point in time? Open this. It's the same quotes as always, or the same lines. That's the only thing that I need, and now let's fight. Oh, this look like on. You won't deduct your salary. Oh, I thought it was gonna hit the other enemy as well, but it didn't. That kind of sucks. I'm not sure I like her gameplay style too much because she's only supposed to be a support character. Nice. Oh, I like that she actually leaves a cut. Yeah, she leaves cuts. Man, the attention to detail on this game. It's too good. It's just too good. That dealt a lot of damage. Maybe the thing about her is that she deals way more damage. Oh, nope. Nope. Just gotta make sure that this, those guys don't attack me. I should probably deal with these guys first. Yeah, it seems like she deals a lot of damage. To anyone that's broken. Yes, Masta. But probably should have held the attack button. This is good enough. I should probably check her abilities or her like skills. I only know that she's supposed to look hold it. And I don't know if her passive is about holding and dealing more damage the more that you hold it. Or if the uh, extra damage that she's currently dealing to the enemies because she's dealing a lot of damage the moment the uh, their, their like uh, defense is broken. They're like anomaly thingy, not anomaly, they're impact, stun gauge thingy. When it's broken, she starts dealing so much damage. And the reason that I'm thinking about it is because uh, when I started playing the game, I saw a couple of people calling her trash. 
and probably they call her trash even more because she's the uh the free character so they're probably thinking just like ah they gave her to us as a free character but only because she sucks dingy surrounding lights suddenly flicker intensely she probably has like a good way to play her and maybe just people didn't know about it because that damage was pretty good but whenever like enemies uh stun gauge wasn't like uh broken or whatever that might be that uh the thing that i'm doing i forgot its name um whenever it wasn't like uh the bar wasn't filled she was doing like normal damage the same damage as i count and the same damage as like Irina. What, the ghost? I mean, we've seen a lot of ghosts. Red ghost, blue ghost, what rumors? Hmm? Is it something that I shouldn't know? You lazy teenager. And surely they wouldn't mean to dispose of me, right? They wouldn't have cutting do that, right? Mm -hmm. Well, they do work on cleanups, so yeah. Oh, they're talking about the ghosts. They are indeed talking about the ghosts. Uh, we only heard about it from Nicole, and you know, scared Nekomara, scared Billy, and scared Ambi. Hi hi Yuki Hana, welcome in. How are you doing? I'm doing well. Just doing some uh story mode for senseless zone serial. The Z Z Z the C's I mean, those little like red ghost enemies did show up when the lights turned off, but then we used the infrared to get rid of them. But still, those little like red ghosts, I wonder what they are because they're talking about this like whole supernatural thingy. You're doing well, that's good to hear. Good to hear. Uh, because we've seen like those ghost thingies and you'd think that after seeing those ghosts, you'd be thinking, oh, there's actually something supernatural going on. But so far, they, they haven't mentioned anything about it. How's your stream go journey going? Pretty good. Thanks for asking. <laughs> well, I'm just having fun by myself. And I think that's the important part, just having some fun. After all, this is more of like a, a hobby kind of thing rather than me thinking of this as, uh, you know, just like trying to do this as full time. Are you enjoying it? Yeah, of course. <laughs> if I didn't enjoy it, I wouldn't be doing it. Mm. Oh, so that was their commission. Clean up the area, find out what is causing the rumors, and then tell the master of the towers that, like what's going on, so that the master of the towers can put up some like information or something like that, and just keep the value of the battle towers up. Are you a daily streamer? No. Um, I stream. I don't really have like some sort of like schedule or anything of the sort. I sort of just stream when I feel like it and when I have time kind of thing so that's why you're here hmm. 
黒騎士様当初は私どもとしてもこの噂をよた話した類だと思っておりましたですが先ほどの状況を鑑みるに停電に関しては本当なのかもしれませんいや、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のことで、もう一度のこ Well, right now,、um, playing only this for like a couple of like weeks, I've only been playing CTC because I want to catch up before the、uh, next update, which is going to be happening next week. And But other than that,、uh, I've been playing Honkai and other gacha games in general. And then after I'm done like catching up with those like gacha games, I'm thinking of like starting to like,、uh, you know, just like be more var variety and play other games. There's just a bunch of games that I want to play. Uh, and a lot of games that I haven't played like、uh, before, you know, just like playing like a blind playthrough of them. Hmm. Is this the end of the mission? I'll be very surprised if this is the end of the mission. Yeah. Right, I forgot. There's this. If you're about to enter the critical stage of your commission, please note that once it started, you can no longer explore freely. Continue? Wait, not yet. I am missing one of these things, and I don't know where. Wait, maybe I should use this. How long have you been streaming, like in general? Uh, how long has it been? A couple of months? Where is it? Not over there, not over there. Is it not here? Might not be here, and it might be on the next area. And the game might just be warning me about it in case、uh, I end up missing the two that are in this area. Yeah, should be fine. Here we go, on to the next area. Did you make this model by yourself? No, I got a free one. From the internet. Mm hmm. In for a camera. Go and talk, talk to the little dude. Here it is. It takes more de most dedication to make this type of model? Uh, Not really. If I remember correctly, this is just like a free model, so it didn't actually take that much dedication from like the artist. It's sort of just like the bare minimum. Just some tracking here and there. Is there another one? Nope.、Oh, to head back. About this. Hmm. Desuwa? So far, there's two characters that use Desuwa here. Grab this and this. That's where the Mr. Ghost was. Oh, these are the doors. I see. Oh. Hmm. There's way too many Mr. Ghosties here. What am I supposed to do? Can I turn them on? Oh, right, I can get rid of them with this. Forgot about it. There we go. I just gotta be careful and grab this. I guess I can heal myself up. Go. Can you introduce yourself to, to me? Well, haven't you already introduced yourself to, to me? You're Yuki Hana, after all. Yuki Hana 91. You're about to enter. Yeah. 
the end of the stage. Dude, she deals so much damage. Also shards that one up. Oh, that delayed attack is so annoying. Close. Apparently you make you make R for your V2 or Spindle, that's nice. Oh I forgot to switch. There we go. Back to Rina. Back to Light Town. Whoa. And this should be the kill. There we go. Cutscene. More flickering lights. <laughs> <laughs> Why does he have to be so damn cool? <laughs> Wait, that's true. She has the saw. She actually cut through the train the other the when we actually found her. Can she cut through the uh, the fire exit thingy partition? Any ideas on how to open the door? Mm. あたりを見てきますから少しだけお待ちくださいまし。リーモ、そんな面倒いことしなくていいって。うん。手伝いできてるからまあまあ頑丈だけどさ、私。いや、that's <laughs> Our master told us to just like only investigate this area, but it is master's like uh you know building and property, so we cannot damage it. Mm-hmm. 
ご主人様的には噂さえなんとかできればいいんでしょ誰も言わなきゃバレないんですか I mean, the ethereals haven't broken anything else inside the building, so the only people that would be breaking stuff in here would be us, you know? Localized structural changes, so it's probably gonna just go down. This area is supposed to be like the bridge, right? Between the two buildings. Shudo的シャッターを動かせる装置は渡り廊下の向こう側に設置されておりました。誠に遺憾ながら現時点でここを通るすべはございません。ここは一度離脱し、急速を取りましょう。ビクトリア火星は必ずや停電の原因を究明
Let's get some sleep. What do people think of Hollow Raiders Ballet Twins Day Trip Adventure? Everybody knows the Ballet Twins in Eridu. It's one of the most famous spooky places in New Eridu. It used to be one of the most popular business hubs before the fall of the old capital, but the Ballet Group suffered heavy losses after the fall and eventually went bankrupt. Uh, the building which symbolizes the rise and fall of the Ballet Fortune was also caught in the hollow and has been corrupted all this time. Only a small, safe area remains exposed. Officials have designated the area as high risk and are restricting entry. But that just makes it more exciting, right? I'm a veteran proxy with 10 years of experience and offer day trips to the ballet building. So I have a 100% survival rate. Well, I mean, yeah, of course, because you're still typing this. I'm trustworthy and very affordable. Send a direct message if you're interested. That sounds very suspicious. Here we go. You close your eyes and can hear the sound of bell typing on the keyboard downstairs. As always, Bell's typing has such intensity, like playing a musical instrument. Listening to the sound makes you feel reassured. After a good night's sleep, you feel rejuvenated. I wonder how Victoria Housekeeping's investigation into the power outages at Bell Twins is going. I should talk to Bell about it. Contact Lackhound with Bell. Charlotte? Oh, it's because we're finally back on the uh, the normal dinghy. Do I have time? I do have time. Niche. First, gotta check some things real quick. All right. Oh, hey, you're back. Ask about the Ballad Twins. Confirm. You want to know if Victoria contacted me? Actually, I was just to pay you a visit. I can just called, and he said he has an idea on how to solve the power outage. Now that you're here, let's make that call and get the details. <laughs> you call I count. Mm. And the reason for the blackouts? Is it perhaps a big ethereal that we're gonna have to beat up? Mm. And yet, there are still power outages. So, the Oh, do we need to look, look into those rooms and see if they're failing for some reason or if they're like turned off and that's why the power outages are happening? なんで停電しちゃったの地下の発電所に何かあったのかなあ、ほう。そこで故障の原因を突き止められるだけではなく、やむを得ない場合は予備の電力系統に切り替えることで電力の復旧が可能です。Then <笑> our next goal is clear. Find the cause of the malfunction and you'll have completed your mission too. なら、次の目的地は決まりだ。プロキシ様、では早速制御室と発電室の位置を送信いたします。Man, it's always so annoying to just like get random bots in chat. Uh, I should start banning them more. I don't know why. I just think that if in the case that they're actual people, then I'd feel bad for just like banning them. Well, let's head to the control room and generator room with Icon. I feel like it's going to be a long trip. Let's make sure we're ready before leaving. Sure. All right, ready. Story mission, let's go. Footprints in the darkness. Ice and ether. Blocked. Okay. is not with, he, with us today? Maybe Ellen has schoolwork to do? I don't know anything about Codin. Codin doesn't have like much lore. On like videos. For Ellen, we have like her teasers. 
いくつかの手順を踏む必要がございます、うん、まずは制御室に向かい停電の原因を突き止めましょうそれが故障であれ何であれ解決が困難な場合は予備の電力系統に切り替えるんです、うん、次に制御室にとどまり操作を行う側と発電室に向かい予備のエーテル発電機を起動させる側の二手に分かれます Oh, and that's why it's only like Han and Rina, and the other team is going to be Ellen and Corin. Sayo Sudeva, Denki Kairo no Fuzatna Sosa, Yoku Salimasio. Hono Naka de Tekinin Gairuto Stara, Soreva Raikan Sandesone. If for no Hatsden Hitua Hatsden Kito, Eter Genio no Unfanga Omoni Narode Shota. And Ellen and Corinne have strength to spare. Mm -hmm. Yep. <laughs> one strains the body and one strains the mind. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> she doesn't want either of them. That's what she said in Japanese. Oh. Ah. <laughs> I mean, isn't this team a little bit too strong? Like, it's the boss, and let's just call her like the vice boss or like the vice president or the second hand. Second hand? I think that's what it's called, right? Balance of combat strength? Mm, that's a good question. You'd think it's Lycaon because he's the boss, but Ellen has a lot of power, like a lot of power. But also, it's not like Cody is like weak, like at all. She's just clumsy. <laughs> Man, off she goes. Mm. Oh, I cannot activate those. Those are like broken. I cannot activate those either. Slowly but surely, slowly but surely. Oh, it's one of the friendly ghosts. Eh? Was that supposed to be like a ghost thingy? Five little dolls, one slipped away. Lost its pad, alone it roamed. It looked everywhere, no friends to guide its way? Eh? I need to find five dolls. Is this perhaps like a secret thingy or is this my current objective just finding the dolls? Can it run around it? I can. Because I just TP you with this. Here's another doll. Four little dolls, one fell behind. Gold and silver, shiny and fine, great to hold, and it met its end. That's another Mr. Ghosty, plus one flashlight. Nothing over here. Here's another doll, three little dolls, one hid in a shack, hiding in the shack, safe and secure it seemed. Now only its bones remain, withered in the dark. Creepy? 
I'm still not using my flashlights. If I can do this without using my flashlights, then I'll take it. <gasps> Oops. <laughs> Oops. Wait, where am I? Oh gosh, I'm lost. Uh, the talking doll seems to be out of battery for a long time. Is it an illusion? The little dolls went hit in the shack. No, 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 no. Okay, so I need to head up. I think this was it. Yeah, it's right there. I'm still not gonna do it. Ah, okay. So I can do it, do it when it's only one, but if there's two, I need to be careful. Two little dolls, one loves to brawl. One loves a brawl. Too clever by half. It outsmarted itself. I joke by fate. A deadly rival sprawled. I don't think there's anything else, right? Yeah. Now I can head out. Wonder what happens if this fills up. Well, I'm not going to be finding that, that out now since I just grabbed one of the things that uh, removes pressure from me. Oh, one little doll, one little doll. Good and evil, virtual and sin. I looked back in its tears. There's no turning back. A journey one faces, a one-way track. All right, and I definitely use my flashlight here. Hmm. And now I have zero pressure, so that means that I'm not gonna get anywhere close to 100 and find out what the hell that's gonna end up doing for me because I don't have corruption. Seven little dolls, five holding hands. A metal box soon pass, swift like the wind. Two dolls left behind, away from their friends. Okay, a different voice comes through the doll. So there is a monster here. <laughs> Our punishment? Were they doing something in the ballet towers? Two out of the elevator, so we could. Did they push two people out of the elevator in order to, uh, so they could escape, and those other two people that got pushed out died? Was that what happened? The fracture recording stops, leaving the silence to envelop the surroundings once more. Hmm. Mm -hmm. And I'll be taking that. Oh god, that's a lot of money. I don't know what this is though. What is this? Today, rescue operations for the ballet are reaching their final stages. The rescue squad found traces of five people being trapped near the control room, but did not find any survivors. Experts speculate that these survivors became trapped in the building while trying to use an elevator to escape. The group carried many high value items and emergency supplies. However, the disaster Compromise the elevator's load-bearing capacity, ultimately leading to tragedy. Experts have also found incomplete footprints of two different pairs of dancing shoes on the edge of the elevator doors. Maybe they belong to the dancer, dancer sisters. Uh, so those five dolls were the people that got stuck in the elevator and died because of it. But before they got stuck on the elevators, they probably pushed the dancers out of the elevator and tried to escape by themselves because of the load bearing dinghy, uh, even though they still ended up getting stuck in the elevator. And so the, uh, the dancers ended up like leaving and the only ones that ended up staying were, you know, those five people. Down? Okay. First, take a shower. Gonna make sure that I'm not missing anything. Since I only have one out of three. 
An enemy. Hmm? Okay, there we go. Into battle I go. Alright, it's just gonna be... Dina and Lycaon. So I'm probably gonna do the swap. Since he's gonna be... He's, he's my stun character. Get the dolls out and then go back to Lycaon. Oh, I can also use this little guy. Yeah, I can just do this. That pancake deals a lot of damage, more than I would have expected. Nice too. And this should be it. This is such a nice song for the stage though. The piano. It fits Victoria House Hipping. Trying to appear behind me. Nice try, buddy. Why the hell does that pancake deal so much damn damage? Also, Lycaon's voice actor is really good as well. A little like screw. 10,000! Huh? Did I just see that Bang Boo deal 10,000 damage to the enemy? Also, oh god! This piano, dude. I can't, I can't. It's too good. That kind of starts working a few minutes later. I flip in love piano and violin. Those are like my two favorite instruments ever. I remember when I was like a teenager, I wanted to learn violin just because violin, I thought violin was cool. But a uh, good thing my mom didn't follow up on... <laughs> And actually uh, getting me like a violin and having to like learn it because it probably would have done it for like a single week and then I would have dropped it because I like hearing it but I don't think I'd like playing it it's wrong mm -hmm. But。So the power outages are coming from somewhere else, not from the power stations. Mm -hmm. It's probably gonna be an, an ethereal with like its electric powers. Mm. Maybe. 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 Sir, yes, sir. Oh, is this gonna be the end? Can't be, right? 
I don't have all the thingies. Yeah, I'm still missing two. Back to the infrared cameras. Why is this one off though? Hmm. This is supposed to be like a puzzle. I guess it was a puzzle. It's a lot of money. Uh, I'm gonna grab the Mr. Ghosty over here. Anything over here? There's an enemy there. There's another enemy there. The one that actually ended up catching me. There's another Mr. Ghosty over here. There's Corin and Ellen. Here's one of the things. And I'm still missing one. Which is... Actually, I don't know where it is. I can't see it. Strange. Maybe there's another area? Can I turn this all off? No, I can't. Yeah, I can't. Hey. <laughs> she just pushes me away. <laughs> I'm sorry, like on. Hmm. I'm ready. <laughs> Drusilla and Anastella. Oh, this is a new area. Oh, or, or is it? Bye bye. Kokomadi, Kokomadi. We're probably going in for red mode right now to see if there's something down here. Since this area wasn't open before. Alright, there we go. I see it. There's nothing there. Uh, that's the way back. That's the one thing. I don't get this. This is going to be a puzzle. I just wonder what type of puzzle it's going to be. Because it's very straightforward. Oh, nice. Well, that's why I never saw any enemies here. Uh, right here. Hmm. An anti-corruption generator is in good condition, but it seems to be missing something important. Hmm. This one too? Just like other generators, its dashboard has no error display whatsoever. The energy module.
There we go. And this is like the last spot. It looks like it wasn't just my imagination. Several of the fuel cells in the generators show slight scratches from being forcibly removed. Elevator, huh? <laughs> There's a one-way special fissure in the elevator. Once you step into it, you won't be able to return. If there are other things to do nearby, you should take care of them first. Uh, uh, but I don't see... What is this? Why are there so many Mr. Ghosties here? I can't find that. Maybe if I destroy all the enemies? But I can't. Okay, that was weird. Oh, I can't go over there because I need to use the teleporting thingy. But still, there's nothing over here. There was nothing behind them. I'll probably have to do this mission again later. That sucks. Uh, R. Leave now. If this ends the mission, then it's whatever. I'll just do this quest later on. Or like this mission. Shouldn't be too bad. No. Oh, that's cute. She's talking about her classmates. Oh, she actually blocks them. Nice. Eight thousand damage pancake. The strongest pancakes in the world. Oh, nice. All right, nice. This is another area. Hmm. Oh, there's the fuel cells. <laughs> ah. I should probably find all these dudes first, if possible. Alright, let's turn this. Done. Hmm. Well, that did nothing. Surely it can only change its like path. It only has like two path changes, right? Can only, like, for example, this one can only move left and right. It cannot go up. Surely, right? Can I actually grab the next one? No. It's no next one. I'm just gonna think that that's the... Wait, I just saw the thing move at the top. That's not good. <laughs> but it's fun. Don't you think it's fun, Ellen? Hmm. Who's gonna grab the third one? Don't tell me I'm the one that's gonna grab the third one. Oh, I guess I am grabbing the third one. 
見しましたさっさと戻って核電気を再起動しよう Right, now let's check uh, with the infrared to see if I missed something. It doesn't look like it. I don't know why there's a control thingy up here. This one? I'll step on it just in case. Alright, never mind. The shape of the ether fuel fits perfectly into the device's uh, energy module slot so like a glove. That's definitely it. Here, put a set here. Nice job, cutting. Next one. Who knows? Just stick it in here. Hell in such a mood. <laughs> mm. And last but not least, my cell. All right, now what is this gonna do? Is it gonna turn all the lights on? Yep. ライカオン。お待ち申し上げておりました。プロキシ様。発電室の方は筒がなく進行しておりますでしょうか。After a short wait, yep. Smart,ヒットしたのは建物の電力が復旧しつつあります。また、リートの制御室に影響が及ばないよう、エイトの電源は独立させました。Smart, but that also means that we're gonna have to go to the power room for Tower B in order to just like get the power going for Tower B, because right now it doesn't have any power. Hmm. ご友人の消息がそこで掴めるとよりのですが。Here Perfect. I was very scared that I was going to miss that. I'll just move slowly. Just in case. Ah. Or just go around them. Bye bye. Hot I count. Oh, there he is. <laughs> there we go. What about Rina? Oh, nice. I got the triple S tier characters. Last of Spato! Heal. Right. Now this is the final battle. As to as now, I wonder what's gonna happen. Are we gonna find a special ethereal here? This shouldn't be the end. Oh. <laughs> <Cute>. <laughs> hmm? A backpack. Hmm? Is this rains? It is rains. Hmm? Eh? 
Wait, is this gonna call the dancers? Oh. Hey. <laughs> How fitting. So there are dancers here, or at the very least, especially Pearl is a dancer. How stylish! No wonder he has so many fans. Oh, I missed it. I should do this. I can't. And I don't think this is a big boss, so it should only be two, right? No, never mind. It's three. 10,000 damage pancake! Easy. Now, back, back on. And finish off with 10,000 damage pancake. That pancake is really loud, too. That should be it. Easy. Oh, my hand. Mm. Oh. Are there always drifts down the ledges? Hey. Fuck, <laughs> Ellen. God. Damn. That's my chart, girl. <laughs> oh. Ah, uh, but who are they? Oh, she out of energy? Hmm. So this is where the plot starts thickening. I've seen those enemies before. They're on the um they're on the HIA VR training thingies. But uh even though I've seen them, I actually have like absolutely no information about them. They're not part of like the uh, the public security or anything of the sort. They have like different types of like suit and they have like those like red colors that just scream out, these guys are enemies kind of thing. Huh. So I think it's about time that we found out who they are. Just a little shock, that's all. Yeah, seriously. First it was the dancer that suddenly showed up, and then after that it's the missiles. Although Ellen did a damn fine job at looking really cool in that cutscene. Mm, Fairy is very strong and powerful, but uh, I guess she can do everything. I don't know if it's because she's like stuck in the HDD and the HDD has limited processing power, and that's why Fairy can't do like literally everything, uh, or if just Fairy isn't that strong. Yeah, 
Good question. Mm. Yeah, things just keep getting more and more troublesome. Just somebody that knows how to call out an ethereal to attack us. And then somebody that has like enough like money to equip those like un unidentified soldiers with like, you know, they're like fully equipped. They have like armor, they have like helmets, they have like everything, and they have like a bunch of like rocket launchers because they didn't only shoot one rocket, they shot mul multiple rockets before running away. So they're very, very equipped. Yeah, even if we try to say literally anything to Victoria Housekeeping, we don't know anything. We're just trying to find rain, and that's literally it. Mm. Yeah, that whole thing about her falling asleep, I wonder if that's why she talks so much about energy and like eating candy. Uh, like she mentioned when I first met her at the uh, that little spot, the bay, or like the pier, whatever it was called. That like new area, like the last area before this like version. Uh, she was talking about liking candies. Well, she said that she didn't like candies, or she didn't want to say that she liked candies. But she was also talking a lot about energy. So I wonder if the of all the things that she does, like attacking, uh, or like being so fast and attacking and having like her own like super strength as like the shark girl. I wonder if instead of that being some sort of like a special ability ability that she has from being a shark girl, if it's more of like some sort of like supernatural ability that she has that uh, consumes like her own energy or like her like stamina. And if she uses too much of it, then she just falls asleep. Like what happened on the cutscene? Great idea. I wonder if this is just going to be scripted or if it's going to tell me, oh, you can give uh, your friends presents. Why? are you going to Ballot Twins? It's an emergency, but it seems very suspicious at the same time. Sorry to trouble you. Sure, talk to Victoria Housekeeping and near the Ballot Twins. Which is at the Plaza Walkway. This place. This is where I talked to Ellen. Nighttime, huh? Man, the nighttime looks really good in this game. Like with the hollows, the background. It looks really, really good. I like the fact that they made like the hollows just like shape. It's not just like a random sphere. It has like this, uh, this like thing covering it that's like fluctuating. And other than that, there's like also this like whole. This like rainbow thingy. It looks really nice. I like the design of like the uh, this like hostile area that they uh, added to this game. Oh, here's the dude. Where's Ellen? Yeah, I'll find out. Okay, there's the other guys. I don't know where Ellen is. It's fine. It's fine. Well, I I'm not here to hurt you, but uh, I think Irina can hurt you a lot. They were talking about how she's very, very violent, so yeah. <laughs> As expected of the Yonessa. <laughs> so it wasn't really interrogation tactics. He just tried to run away and failed miserably. Rebel army. 
治安局に引き渡された末にどんな結末が待ち受けているかよくご存知のはずです。ああ、and I'm gonna guess that the bargaining ship is gonna be if you tell us all that we need to know or everything that you know, we won't、uh, turn you over to the public security and we just let you go. あなた方がバレーツインズに入れ込んでいらっしゃる理由を明確にご説明いただければ、私どもとしても寛大な対応を検討したく存じます。Yes, if we don't have any affiliation to the public security, plus if the public security knew that we were just like raiding a hollow, the ballot tower is hollow, then they get angry at us and would probably get arrested as well. So yeah, it's kind of a troublesome situation. わかった。うちの部隊のスポンサーから依頼があったんだバレーツインズのビートオフショーでそいつの代わりにあることをやれってうん、that's a very specific area and that's where we're trying to go to 申し訳ありません、mm-hmm. もう少し具体的な内容を伺えますでしょうか俺はただの下っ端なんだ<笑>詳しいとこまでは知らない俺ら何人かは周辺の警備を任されただけなんだ、oh. バレーツインズに侵入したやつを見つけ次第、ビートから遠ざけろって。うん、でも、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それで、それそれで隊長が言ったんだあれはただものじゃないこの人たちが来たに来た連中に違いないからあの妙なエーテリアスを先導してぶつければと So I wonder if they're trying the thing that they need to do at the、uh, on the rooftop of tower B is capture Rain or if they already have her captured and we need to save her from like the、uh, from being like captive or being the, ta- being the captive Of whatever the hell this、uh, organization is. Mate, Ima Nanto Konusne. Oops, Ojo Sandra, Taisho to be. Hmm, I don't trust you. Ima Shigatano has again. Anata Sama no Butanga, Rain Sama, you guys, the digits of Mitometa to try to your Roshi de Shoka. Mina. <laughs> of course, I have to run back and see what's going on here. Dear soldier, the night is still long, so we have enough time for a nice chat. Please don't hold back. <laughs> I am not screaming. <laughs> I'll talk, I'll tell you everything. <sighs> Since the soldier is being very accommodating, ask whatever you like. Oh! Oh, I can ask him! Oh, nice! Ask about the ethereal at the atrium. That ethereal. After a captain arrived with the girl you were looking for, her media player made some noise which immediately attracted the monster. It gave us quite the scare. Later on, we discovered it's sensitive to sound, so whenever someone came in, we would use the sound to attract it and have it deal with the intruders. What's the generator room you're doing too? Are you talking about the fuel scattered throughout the building? We intentionally removed them to stop anyone from using the generator room. No wonder the generator was covered in signs of being forced to forcefully dismantled. Oh, I still need to ask more questions. There was another question. Yeah, there's two more questions actually. Ask about the militants' recent movements. Our operation started around three weeks ago. To familiarize ourselves with the terrain and ensure our mission goes sm- smoothly, we've been visiting the building intermittently to reach Tower B's rooftop in the shortest time possible. Did you bring Miss Rain? Yeah, she is in combat personnel, but the captain considered her presence of the utmost importance. So she's with them. So they're supposed to be friends rather than enemies? You bow to bright a garul ghost! Don't you even dare! You changed your name too? Mean. Mean? Yeah? <laughs> How's it going, Ghost? It's been a while. I have to actually see. You didn't really change your name, right? Right? Yeah, you didn't. You're good. You're grinding? What are you grinding today? Are you grinding Fortnite? Or are you grinding some other game? 
What do you have on your menu for today, Mr. or Ms. Ghost Gizmo? 09121W35. It seems Rain found opportunities to send those messages while they visited the building every now and then. You're grinding Valorant? Ugh! You're not grinding Fortnite? What are you doing with your life, brother? Console, right? Oh, right! They, didn't they announce that the uh, console version is actually gonna get released now? Through, like, a trailer? If they were gonna be releasing it that fast, then why didn't they just wait for their normal release without having to do a dumb beta? Get some Fortnite too sweaty? Ah, but you should be sweaty on Fortnite as well. You should, kid those, you should teach those kids who's boss. You're supposed to be older than them, after all. Just beat their asses. I haven't played since Season X, Season 10. How long ago was Season 10? I don't know what Season uh, Fortnite is on right now. Uh, Fortnite Season. Uh, seasons too long i got the fortnite wiki Shut they have chapters how am i supposed to know which one's which oh season oh it's not season 10 it's a literally season x i see okay never mind oh but i see that that was like the last one uh last season four chapter one that means that you haven't been there for eight wait wait i can't count give me a second 8, 12, 19, no, it's 17, 8, 12, 17, 20, 20 seasons, oh, chapter 5, season 2, boy, that isn't that long ago, you haven't played for 4 chapters, eh, it really has been a long time, let me check some things real quick, Okay, there we go. Uh, how did you cannot run? Oh, right. Uh, you mentioned that you're still grinding uh, Valorant. How's that going? Are you grinding rank? Or are you just grinding some levels before the uh, the console version just fully comes out? Because right now it's still in beta, right? It's not like the full version. The captain handled the matter personally. I'm not sure what happened exactly. We may be rebels, but we follow hierarchy, so I don't know much. Uh, I don't think I'll ever be able to go back now that you captured me. Mm-hmm. I think being able to escape that dangerous organization is a blessing for you. Yeah, probably. Uh, you can download it right now. Well, I mean, if I had a console to play it on, then yeah. <laughs> but even if I had a console to play, I probably wouldn't be playing, uh, whatchamacallit. I wouldn't be playing it on a console because, you know, I have like a PC. So, yeah. <laughs> is Ellen back here? No, where's Ellen? Give me Ellen. I want to see sleepy Ellen. <laughs> Uh, there's ranked and ranked swift play, team deathmatch and deathmatch. Mm, so it's the normal ones, ranked and rung and ranked swift play. Oh, there's no spike rush? Huh. That's strange. You just need a third party thingy and you can play console and PC. But why would I even want to play console and PC though? Not yet. Like, I don't see a reason. And, for, but, and the thing that you said as it being like a third party thing, did you mean it like an emulator? To beat up kids? I already beat them up on normal Valorant. No, not actually. I'm, I actually suck at Valorant. I mentioned this before, but uh, precision shooters, I'm pretty bad at them. I just can't. But like racist kids, you mean like most of the players in Valorant? Or like any competitive games, they're like racist and really mean? And sexes and everything. They're literally everything that could be bad. No, like eight year old racist. I mean, if they're eight year old, then the easiest thing to do is just little. Isn't there like a TOS? They shouldn't be able to play if they're eight year old. So just report them. Easy peasy. Hmm. Ah, cracked my wrist. Ah, it feels good, but it hurts. <laughs> ah, my wrist. Mm. Let's see what happens. 
Well, they still need to work on Tower B. We've only finished uh, repairing Tower A. Oh? Who? そのような。ああ、うん。いろんな風説が流布することを。ビクトリア家政が許すわけにはまいりません。また、レイン様の失踪が誘拐によるものであり、ご主人様の財産にまたがり、悪行を働く者がいると判明した以上、見過ごすこと
I'm sure you know this, but a lot of times people from like bronze and silver and iron, they like get uh, trash talk so much because every single time that something happens to them and they cannot climb up, it's always like their teammate. And then you watch their games and it's just like, yeah, sure. It's your teammates and you being garbage at the game. And that's why you can't climb, which is literally going to be me if I ever try to rank. Seriously, I suck. So I know that I'm bad and I know that I need practice. So I just got to get better. That's how I got better at Apex Legends, my brother. You need more practice. You need to go ham. Ah, you need to destroy those children. You need to show them who's the boss, who's like the older dude who goes on uh, trips to Disneyland, Disney World, Six Flags, uh, water parks, uh, Universal Studios. You know, you know what you need? You need some skins. Don't actually go buying skins. Don't use your money for like rent and stuff like that, though. Dude, those skins are really expensive. But you know what they say? Skins equals skill. <laughs> just, uh, just don't go waste your money. Just, just a reminder. Uh, I'm just joking. I'm not pushing you to buy skins. So, uh, yeah, don't, don't go wasting your money, especially if you need it. <laughs> it's very important. It's hard to get. And, uh, mm -mm, uh, uh, inflation is going hard. <laughs> だから Oh Jesus, I jab way too much. I jab for like 20 minutes. Crap. I mean, if they need to do like their own climate thingy, uh, for there to be like a known organization suddenly taking over the tower, then I'm gonna guess that they need to kick that organization out to complete their commission. This might be the last mission for this chapter. With that, Nikon lives in a hurry. I can finally relax knowing the collaboration is secured. Next, let's go check on Ellen and Corinne. Oh, they're together. That's nice. I love... I love my shark girl. I love her. Boss, about just now, remember to record over time. Cute. <laughs> Master Proxy, it's you. Corinne, were you injured? Thanks for asking. I'm fine. Thanks to Ellen. Oh, you're probably here to see Ellen, right? Try not to worry too much. She'll wake up soon. Is that why she's always eating candy? Yep. She's definitely doing that to replenish energy levels. But she also really likes candy. Oh. You placed the candy you brought next to Ellen and just then? Wah! Oh. <clears throat> oh, you're awake, Ellen. Are you alright, Ellen? I'm alright. Just a bit sleepy, that's all. You know what? Oh, that's a lot of candy! Damn! This deck is annoyingly complicated, but boss didn't say anything about it. I'm definitely asking for overtime pay once we're done here. Huh? Why are there candies here? You brought them for me, right, Corin? Oh, no, actually, the proxy brought these candies just for you. Thank you for saving my skin. Saving your skin? Oh, you mean those rocket launcher mobs in the atrium? I just thought if I didn't take them out, things would get even me messier. Not a big deal, really. By the way, I like the candies you brought. You got good taste in snacks, so I'll gladly accept them. You'd have some candies too, especially if you're feeling down, so you got something on your mind. 
to explain the rain situation to her. So, your friend got nabbed by those militants? Sounds like this operation will be a long one. Well, as long as it's not too exhausting. Nah, forget it. Count me in. If it's for- Yo! <laughs> I'll do my best too, Master Proxy. Now that I know Ellen is okay, I should head back and get ready for the operation. Hey yo! Score some points with Ellen. No what? You know, usually when there's like uh, fan art of like some sort of like shipping, um, there are times where there's like absolutely like no connection between them, or just like a small, the smallest of connections between them. And there are times where there's like a little bit of connection and you can see like the shipping actually working out if they push them like on the game because of like both of the personalities or both of like their interactions. This thing is reaction right now is perfect for like the shipping for uh between like Akira and Ellen. Or well Wise and Ellen. It's it's perfect. Like her saying she's normally like super super lazy and stuff like that and she doesn't want to do things because they're like too troublesome. But her saying I'll do it if it's for you. It's a big deal. A big deal. I'll be taking care of Ellen from here, Master Proxy. I heard we're going to rescue Miss Rain. I'll do my best. I prefer hard candies over the chewy ones. This Rain is seriously good. <laughs> well, glad you like them. Mm, they're in the same position as before, so they probably have nothing... Nothing new to say. Uh, where do I need to go? This is not the way to the car. I do need to go to the car. Why did it tell me to go over here? Gosh darn it. I seriously love nighttime. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, I got stuck. What is with that bike? That big bike is so weird. What the hell is wrong with that bike? Oh, Charlotte's still here. I'm surprised that it hasn't locked me into like the story, which is probably gonna happen right now. You're back. Cutting just sent me a message. Victoria housekeeping's ready to go. Clashing with those rebels is uh, rebels is unavoidable once we enter Ballad Twins, so we best be on our toes. Looks like the final battle is upon us. Yep. Yeah, I had the same feeling. So we'll have to figure things out as we go. Anyway, let's think about what we need and prepare well. All set. Let's head out. All right. Let's contact the uh, let's connect the HDD system and meet up with Lycon. And the others inside the hollow. We must rescue Rain. Yes, in action. Uh, how much time do I have? I have 20 minutes. Surely I can finish this mission in 20 minutes, right? Surely. Save Rain from the armed rebels. Right, let's go. ほど私とりなでビルのデイリグチをいくつか偵察してまいりました。判断軍たちは未だ警戒を続けており、立ち去る気配はありません。うん、でも、probably what are they doing? I just can't imagine what they need to do on the building of the ballot towers. On the building of the ballot towers, on the roof of the ballot towers. Hmm. <笑>そうびえる。可能な限り短時間で敵の防衛ラインを突破し、レイン様を助け出さねばなりません。うん、だトランペットだ。レインのことは頼んだよ。マスター、良い知らせをお伝えします。たった今、ビルを飲み込んでいるフォローのデータ分析が完了しました。ビル内のレッツゲームをリアルタイムで検知できます。ナイスジョブ、フェリー。そのこと場を待ってたんだ、フ
just this little guy. Anything over here? There's a little ghost over here. There's the ghost over here as well. You should probably clear all of them out. There we go. There's one. I'll probably get the other one while I'm here. Oh. A few? I think those are a lot. More than a few. Way more than a few. Anyway, I think that's the last one. Yeah, and they head back. Oops. Just trying to give me a hint of what I need to do. An exclusive performance from the genius twin marionettes inside the ballet twins. You're wondering when Bro's gonna finish half the games he started? Bro, I'm about to finish this one soon! And then after that, I'm gonna head on to the next game that I haven't finished, and I'm not even halfway done with those, so yeah, it's gonna be a long time. <laughs> the lights, the sound, and the grand stage, an utterly unique human experience. There's a tiny line stashed away in a barely noticeable corner of the pamphlet. In the event of any emergency during the performance, the Ballet Twins will ensure your personal safety to the greatest extent possible. Okay. Lights on. Should be like no enemies here. So it should be safe. Grab all that money. Fast. It was very fast, but in. What about you, Mr. Ghost or Miss Ghost? When are you gonna be immortal? You've been playing a lot of Valorant ranked and you've been grinding it a lot, but it does still don't see you being immortal, huh? Immortal? Immor immortal? I don't mind my pronunciation, I'm terrible at it. Talon and Marinette sisters are about to stage a special dance performance at the Ballet Twins. However, a series of mysterious incidents have been plaguing the towers. Multiple guests have reported hearing noises coming from empty rooms late at night. Moreover, the dance costumes that the Marinette sisters have stored in the lobby of Tower B were stolen. Fortunately, the customs were later found on the rooftop of Tower B. However, surveillance footage from the building failed to capture any suspects. The writing on the back is severely stained and illeg illegible. <clears throat> oh. Hi, Sue. Now, I guess I'm just gonna have to fight them. There's no other choice. The music, though. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> This should be it for this enemy. On to the next side. Man, this team is pretty strong, not gonna lie. Stop attacking me, please! Also, for, please give me back my sound. Yes, master. Yes, master. Hehehehe. <laughs> 
I love her quotes. A briefcase. Oh. I kneel at you, Onesama. I kneel at you. I kneel for you. Kokoi. <laughs> I love Ellen. <laughs> She's so cute. But we aren't at the rooftops yet, right? She should be at the rooftops. Also, Drawn Rina is absolutely gorgeous. Just like Grace. Grace on her like comic version look absolutely stunning. うん。ご命令です。そちらは<笑> Common knowledge, sure, dude. So, 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 これは司法府の専用飛行船じゃないか。other than that, she's just been been there, just watching, staring, slowly judging in silence. Hmm. Eh? And because he's a robot, and because he can't breathe, because he changed like his thing to be uh to like not take in uh oxygen, he's the only one that has stayed awake. Nekomata. <laughs> I love her. <laughs> She's so cute. <laughs> Oops. So whatever there was inside of that uh, suitcase was like some sort of like very very strong sleeping gas that took out literally everyone the moment that it actually opened, and it's probably gonna take out the pilot as well, and this thing's gonna go down. が消すを開けたとだ。中から煙が噴き出してきやがってよ。操縦士を含め、飛行船にいる全員が気を失っちまった。俺は吸気システムが故障してたから、何を逃れたが。なんだって。それなら今は誰が飛行船を動かしているん
外部に動きがあるようには見えませんうん Was like this is Rain's handiwork どうやらレインの仕業のようだ飛行船の制御を乗っ取りつつ信号を偽装して正常に飛んでいるように見せかけているなあなあ船長たちどういうことだなんでレインがここで出てくんだよビリー様手短にビリー様<笑>レイン様は反乱軍によって誘拐されました彼らはレイン様を利用しあなた方の飛行船を掌握しています、うん、なんだって待ってくれ本当にレインの仕業なら治安局ごときじゃどうにもならねえぜ俺らもうおしまいなのか<笑> We can take out the,、uh, the people that abducted Rain and then ask her to actually turn back the blimp Over to like its normal cur course cut root. Torano Kubikara Suzu had Serinova. Soreo Sketa Hitokeda. Conajo Kyo Nantoka de Kirinova. Rain Sky Nai. Proxy Samano Oshar Tordes. Midi Sama. Victoria Casewa Genzai. Proxy Samato Tomoni. Rain Samo Kushit Subek. Vare Twins in Mass. Rain Samo Sumiakani Torimoto Skotoga de Kireba. Yeah. Oops. Sorry, Billy. I got to trigger happy with my space bar. Fifteen meters above the Ballot Twins. Huh. So we don't have much time. All right, let's go. Okay, never mind. More talking. We wait. All right, time to head out. Yep, use the key. Oh, already. Should probably use the infrared first. Ah, oh, never mind. Because there's only a clue thingy here. Probably to tell me where the next objective is. Where is this? Oh, the dancer is here. Hey. Two dancers. It's the twin dancers. Everything's going crazy. Crazy. Oh, this is the last spot. All right, I need to grab two of these things before I get here. Probably. For first. This. There might be another one, so I'm gonna check around. Just look around real quick. Nope. Okay. Maybe there is another floor. Master, the Ballot Brothers insisted insist that mysterious incidents around the buildings are nothing more than industrial sabotage by business rivals, insisting that the events uh, that these events won't delay or cancel the upcoming dance. Reports claim that the owners of the Ballot Twins, the Ballot Brothers, are currently facing significant financial strife. The two have poured money into the event and invited celebrities from various fields. This lavish event may be their last chance to attract new business partners and escape their financial woes. The text on the back is uh, severely stained and illegible. Gotta grab the key. Gotta open this up. Yeah, 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 I have the money. Yeah. 
Uh, I don't think I need the heal, but I'll grab it anyway. Now, this is the important key because I want my loot. Boom. And this. During the intermission, I ran outside the green room to listen in and they seemed to be arguing and I could hear an old man's voice saying, Stop the show. You punks have to be joking. Just think about what day it is today and who's come to see the show. And think about yourselves again. You already won praise and glory. Next, I promise you all your freedom. That's enough. Shut up. And no more sensationalist stuff. You've signed the contract. Hmm. So something else was going on. Alright, onto the rooftop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I grabbed everything that's uh, that I needed. I think. If I didn't, then it's fine. Here we go. I need to rush towards them. These guys are pretty low HP, so I should just do this. be able to hit at the very least two enemies and I didn't be one more enemy right can't be over that easily okay never mind it's over that easily hmm. oh the train Can I do something with the infrared? Probably not. Can I do anything with him? No. Can I sneak around him? Maybe? Surprise! Let's do rain first. Oh, nice try. Alright, there's still one more in set of enemies. I think I'm doing really well though. I'm cleaning them really fast. Alright, I'm 
ことを警戒せねばなりませんどう押し流されろ Oh, they didn't deal as much damage as I thought it would. Perfect, they're all stacked. And they still don't die. There we go. Hey, that was a perfect battle if I say so myself. Oh, there we go. ええ。宿主の最優先事項は完了した。我々は逃げられん。これ以上命をかけるのは損だ。Now the question is Who's the one that's gonna save her? Is it gonna be Rina with the bang boost or is it gonna be Lackhound? Lycon. <laughs> Why is she always so damn cute? <laughs> no point, we got the hostage, and we still need to do the thing about the blimp. Yeah. <laughs> レイ。大丈夫か。怖がらなくていい。もう大丈夫だ。僕たちは2個の友達で君を助けに来た。君たち本当に私を助けに来てくれたの？早く見るのを屋上に行かないと。もう時間がない。地方部の飛行船が。
牧場へ行って防御装置を取り除くだけでいいけど What? 反乱軍が言ってた万全を期すために飛行船に乗ってる全員を眠らせたって制御が戻ったとして誰が操縦してホローを避けるの And there, that's where Bill comes in Bill, Billy そこが困ったところだ BD だけはまだ起きているけど飛行船の操縦なんてきっとできないプロキシ様レイン様が飛行船の制御を戻してくださるのでそれで十分でございます以降はビクトリア火星にお任せください入手した情報によれば飛行船はバレーツインズの上空からわずかのところをかすめるように飛ぶとのことあれ Gonna like hit it really hard and change its course? So, j u s h i g a Yunai no de Ariba, but Akshima Kawario t s t o m e m a s h o Tosho no de Vichiwa comes in in Hokai. What? Yat the Kurita Monodes. This is a Prokishi Sama, Besuto, Miss Kurita Saimasta. What is that lock? Adjacent areas are automatically displayed when exploring a hollow. Okay, this one's pretty easy. Yeah. Prokishi Sama no Minokonashi. Kono Raikan. Kan Fukurita Shimashita. Like Kan. I should heal myself. Also, uh, I need to know where the last thingy is. I didn't miss it, right? It's not there. It's not that. There it is. Okay. That was close. Okay, perfect. They didn't get to fight a single one of them. Uh, I don't need it. I need to finish with this fast. So it sucks that I skipped the dialogue. Alright, what's the last clue? My speculation is correct. The lobby of Tower B must be near this a special fissure connecting to the rooftop. Whether it's weird noises or disappearing costumes, all signs point to a hollow disaster happening in the Ballet Twins. To ensure that charity performance could be held according to schedule, the Ballet Brothers inexplicably took a desperate risk and decided to hush, e hush up everything. I just can't believe the two, uh, that two such good people just vanished here for good and ended up being seen as symbols of hate in urban legends. Even though their souls linger on here, I trust that they'll be as elegant and beautiful as ever. Running on the back is really ah,、uh, so it's talking about the、uh, the dancers. Continue. I need to finish this quick. Run out of time. Nice. Top of the jump. Dancer time. Do you know what's going on? まだご満足いただけていないご様子。There's no way it's alone this time, right? Yep. Yep. <laughs> Damn, I got chills. That was so good.
当の心得がありそうです。ミズラ、見かけている場合ではありませんね。<笑>I was like on the way to it though. <laughs> so much. <laughs> this is so cute. 
あと二三時間もすれば目を覚まされるでしょう。来館さんたちには借りができたな。うん。過分なお言葉です。私どもとしてもプロキシ様という地球を得られ、光栄の至りでございます。And I hope we get to work again soon. Work together again soon. あなた様のご協力の会あって、私どもはご主人様の名誉をお守りすることができました。店長。治安局から連絡が来たぜ。救助隊と航空隊がこっちに向かってるってさ。ナイス。ビリー、レインだけれど、彼女はハッカーだし、脅されたとはいえ、飛行船をハッキングしてしまったのは事実だ。We need to get her out of here. 治安局に捕まると面倒になる。うん。先に僕たちとフォローから脱出するよ。治安局の人が来たら何と言うか、ちゃんとわかっているだろう。俺は麻酔を吸わなかったから緊急事態に気づいて飛行船を操縦<笑>ここに不時着させた What a hero <笑>それにしてもよこんなことが起きちまってビジョンの裁判は予定通り進むのかねうーん、probably difficult Actually that big uh The Daruma dude is probably gonna get in more trouble now まずは治安局がパールマン様を連れ戻すでしょうか、mm -hmm. 裁判は日を改めてとなる可能性が高いでしょうね。ビリー、ここは任せだ。僕たちは行くよ。キッド、キッド。ああ、店長たちも気をつけて帰るんだぜ。みんな。<笑>はい。You just figured that out? You didn't think it was kind of suspicious after the last time that you actually saw that woman? Wait, he's probably gonna get chased, isn't he? Isn't he cooked anyway? Brother's cooked. All right, finally. Okay, please do not give me dialogue the moment that I get back. It's probably gonna give me dialogue the moment that I get back. Shh. Nope. Oh, as expected of a pro hacker, she doesn't have a 近況を聞いてみよう。はあ、これで記憶阻止のことは一段落。だとしても、パールマンが飛行船を奪って逃げちゃったのはな。ビジョンの裁判も延期せざるを得なくなっちゃったもんね。それに、インターノットで見たんだけど、ゲイバーズインズのペイラペンを結局ビルの購入を諦めて、違約金を支払ったんだって。へえ、わい。あの2体の変な衛星なのか、飛行船ハイジャックの無事ケチがついちゃったからか、どっちかはわかんないけどね。Sounds fair. Also, those two dancer ethereals are way too much of like an unknown. We know nothing about them and they just like teleported in and out. They weren't actually like truly hunting us. Like, there's like no reason for them to leave. まあ、そんなことよりもレインに会いに行こう
後でクレタとグレースさんも来るみたいだし。Perfect! I really, really, really need, really, 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 really need to leave. So I'm not gonna be saying much. Uh, probably end up finishing this later. But I, yeah, I really need to leave. So, uh, bye, bye. Uh. Mm.